um, we've got to see if we can earn three ticks. And if you earn three ticks, that tells me you show it. And then as they do the pages each day, um, because we tend to try and do it three times a week, the power of two with them, just for 10, 15 minutes. Establishing those number bonds, recognising numbers, even the symbols, it's excellent to start on that. Um, recognising things like the maths language, what's one more, what's one less than, you know, because some children um, struggle with, 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 if you change the term for something or what's the difference between something and being able to show it in the power of two is, uh, you know, is a great help, it helps tremendously. With the curriculum moves so quickly, you assume that all children have got their number bonds well established, that can recognise them and can even say big numbers. And you know, and you'll find that that's not always the case. And obviously, the uh, the power of two will, you know, it's it's well well programmed, well set out to pick up those little pitfalls, if you like. It gets quite complex when it gets to here, and and I think it well covers um, what we're what we're doing in the curriculum, and um, and certainly for some children, um, you know, it starts off establishing some of those number bonds at the beginning, making sure they've got them. Some of the children that I work with with this, um, they've been struggling with maths for a while, and sometimes when they sit next to somebody who's fairly good at maths they can get overlooked. Uh, when you start to work closer with them or, or they've done a test and it highlights things that they're not getting and you think, well, by now they should know that. Then you look a little bit closer and with one child, she was struggling with number bonds, just didn't know. So we started this program with her and now, sort of, uh, we're one, two, three terms in from starting it, she'll reel them off, she knows them. It's helped her in other avenues, which when she does tests, it shows the results. I would always, yes, I would recommend it to any school, you know, certainly to, uh, to, to take a look at it. I'm, I am absolutely certain they would find children that would benefit from it. And I have to say, as an adult, I've found, you know, some really useful tips in here as to sort of like, you know, that's a really neat way of doing it or thinking of doing it. We'd heard about it from another school who was doing this or it was an idea and we thought, well, we need to give that a try because with some children you hit a stumbling block and you think, what can we do to help these? So we introduced the power of two and, uh, you know, we found it's working. It's an intervention that, that works. For them. I'd recommend this for all children who are struggling uh, and can't pick up the strategies that helps them to learn when they're in class. So it's an intervention that helps them slowly get the basic knowledge that they need and then they can do the more complicated maths.